Bulls one of the biggest decisions the city of Durham will make in years. Who to hire as the new police chief? People in the Bull City got a chance to sound off on the search at a community forum. As WNCN's Carly Griffith explains, the city got plenty of feedback. What we want to find out from the community is what are those key challenges and responsibilities that the chief would have to contend with, and then we'll structure exercises so we can directly see those competencies firsthand. Transparency was the theme at the first community forum on the search process for a new Durham police chief. Transparency not only in how the new chief will operate the city's police department, but in how the candidates will be sought out and tested. People are concerned that decisions are being made behind closed doors, um, and we want to be able to see the whole process. As many comments or questions were posed about developmental associates' process of vetting candidates, as there were about the successor to current Chief Jose Lopez. Community input's really critical piece of this. President of Developmental Associates Steve Strauss made sure people knew their opinions are being considered and agrees the next chief will play a crucial role in moving Durham forward. I think there's some significant trust issues. I think there's some dramatic changes that are going on in the country with regard to policing and the trust of police and I think the next chief is going to be very critical in terms of turning that around for the, the city of Durham. Well, the new police chief has to come in here and engage the young community, the youth, as well as the you know people who've been living here for generations um, and engage them in a way that we can force the trust again. There will be two more forums like tonight's tomorrow. One will actually be catered towards Spanish speaking Durham residents. The other will be a smaller closed session with representatives from area organizations. In Durham, Carly Griffith, WNCN News.